far they keeping it steady, y'all, it's like when I got here, there was about uh, two people, and now there's about five people in line. I think I'm number three right now. This is what it's gonna be, y'all. We are gonna go for the general. The general, corned beef and pastrami, maybe. Yeah. I don't want corned beef, though. I just want pastrami. We just gonna go straight for the beef beef pastrami sandwich, y'all. We gonna leave the corned beef off today. Young man in here waited on everybody, yo. He is very thorough. And uh, we gonna take the sandwich maybe across the street, eat in the car, or maybe I can find a spot outside here to eat. But it's definitely, uh, so far has been a good experience. But I wanna check it out, man. I wanna check it out. I just got the beef pastrami, that was it. Nothing mixed with it. We're gonna see if we can talk to the owner before we leave, get some sound bites. Rock Mahmoud, uh, Big Rock's Deli. Location, uh, 68 Avenue on Bergen Street, North New Jersey, okay. right next to the Green Room Cigar Lounge. Tell us some of the benefits of being an entrepreneur. I mean, you know, the benefit is you work at your own time, your own pace. I mean, you know, it's yours, you know what I'm saying? Uh, I've been working for people for over 30 years, working for somebody else, waiting for every two week paycheck, and it's just time, you know, I'm retiring in three years. Right. And you know, the feeling of actually having your own business and actually knowing that you waking up and doing this for yourself, it actually feels good, you know what I'm saying? And when you got a good product like I got, right, right, right. Uh, and the customer's happy, the, you know what I'm saying, the internet is blowing up, I right. mean, you know what I'm saying, your name, you're building a brand. I mean, it just feels overall good to know that you got the, you've done something from start to finish and it's actually becoming successful. So we're what's, growing. What's so, some of the struggles? I mean, you know, the, the struggle is growth, right? So how do you grow? How do you maintain growth and, uh, you know what I'm saying, make sure that it fits within the budget, uh, that you don't do it too fast. Uh, and, you know, staffing, right? Last question, you know, tell us about the menu. Uh, my menu is corned beef, pastrami, turkey breast, tuna, uh, turkey pastrami, which is the bomb when it's heated, so I just want y'all to know that. Right. Uh, you know what I'm saying? My mother's bean pie, which is like Ooh. the best bean pie, you know what I'm saying, in Not the country. So listen, you know, it's a very simple menu. We are gonna add salads uh, one day, macaroni and potato salad. We haven't done it yet, but you know, very simple menu. When you come here, you know what to get. You know what I'm saying? Oh, Thank you, sir. Right. Yo, we got it right here. And then they got the sodas right here. Let's get the soda, go to the car. There it is, y'all. Look, 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 look. I got the pastrami. Uh, they gave me the pickle on the side. I got the coleslaw on it. I got the cheese right there. I got the cheese on it. It's pastrami, and I forgot the name of this sauce. It's uh, it's the sauce. I gotta get the name of that sauce that's on there, man. Oh man, I forgot the name they gave it to me, but anyway, this is the pastrami, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all the menu right now. There it is on the menu. This is it, check it out, check it out. Let's dig into it and see what's going on. It looks delicious. It absolutely looks delicious, y'all. Let's check it out. Check this out. Check it out. Look at that, man. Look at that. I'm gonna just hold it there because I be moving too fast sometimes. Look at that piece of pastrami with that little piece of fat on there. Look at that black pepper burn on it. I couldn't wait. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I like that meat, right? And some people like very, very lean meat, but it's like already I can tell it's that perfect mixture of leanness and a little bit of fat. I want to dig into it. Lick my fingers, y'all. I got the sauce. Mm, mm, mm. That's really good. I'll keep doing this right here. This is delicious, y'all. The sandwich was $17. Everybody normally asks me, like, you need to put the price up. You gotta watch the video to the end. Anyway, this is really good, y'all. 
y'all know I really love pastrami. And y'all been to Katz's and I've been to Hobbies. This is a good pastrami sandwich. And I like the mixture of that cheese and especially the coleslaw. Because the coleslaw, let me, let me. Yeah, the coleslaw has that hint of sweetness too. Wow, does that taste do it? Mm. Mm. You know, it's not pepper, but it's uh, it tastes a little, just a little hint of that horseradishy taste too. Coleslaw is the bomb that's on there too. Got the pickle here. Let's see if the pickle's any good. That's a good deli pickle right there. <laughs> Check it out, y'all. We got an interview with the owner. He was sharing the ups and downs, you know, of having a business here. I got to pull this this uh, this toothpick out. Got a young man. I couldn't videotape the guy like behind the counter because it's a young cat. You know, uh, the owners, he's making the food. The, the young cat's waiting on people, you know, uh, he's at the register. <laughs> this young cat, I wish I could have videotaped him, is very thorough. But I mean young cat. This cat look like he's about 12 years old. Very thorough, man. And word is born. What better thing to do than to be learning a business at whatever age? I got to find out how old that cat was. Uh, learning business at that age instead of hanging out. Ain't nowhere to hang out right now. You know, it's time to get on here and learn this business. That's mathematics. That's business, entrepreneurship, everything right in there. But anyway, look at that. Tell me that don't look good. Let me just hold it there for a minute. One long minute. <laughs> and you see me biting into it. They don't skimp on the meat. Mm. I'm dropping. So, this is what it is, y'all. It's Friday. The owner said he's only open Friday, Saturdays. I can't remember if he said Sunday, but I'm going to play it for y'all if y'all didn't hear it already. We're right here on Bergen Street and 16th Avenue, right next to the uh, Cityplex theater okay what is that is that like that peppery goodness you know it's spices pepper cured I'm gonna look it up on the internet what is that I'm gonna write it down here right when the pastrami has that black pepper burn on the outside of it let me taste it mm -hmm. it's definitely seasoned <laughs> really tasty video wasn't long this is matt dv over on 16th Ave in bergen street oh my last video was on bergen street shout out to all our subscribers if you're not a subscriber please help a brother out subscribe thanks to our patrons if you're not a patron and want to help out become a patron patreon.com front slash matt dv williams if you want to buy me a cup of coffee, if you look at the bottom of this video, you'll see a dollar sign support. Hit that button. You can give us $2, $3 to buy us a cup of coffee. So when we're editing, I drink a lot of cups of coffee. <laughs> I do. The flavor in this meat is the bone. Mm -hmm. Some of you guys from Newark, no Coopers. Y'all know hobbies. Y'all know catches. This is another one to put on the list. A lot of people say Coopers, Coopers, Coopers. But this man right here, on the, on the, and you be these little trucks, man, the vendors. I call them vendors. They're food trucks. That's what they are. Food truck vendors. They're vendors when they're at an event. But they be doing their thing, man. You know? Mobile doing their thing. Big up. This is Matt DV. Nobody told you they love you today. You are hanging with the wrong people. I love you cats. Have a beautiful day. I'll see y'all at the next one. Peace. Got to use that cheese to express yourself. See y'all at the next one.